What's going on, everybody? Dan Unfiltered. Checking out Being as an Ocean Lost. I've heard Catch the Wind. Is that what it's called? Catch the Wind? Catching in the Wind? Catch the Wind. I think it was Catch the Wind. But I heard that a while ago. Fire. Fire stuff. Because I really haven't heard a band like this, necessarily. Like, I've heard elements. Like, like Linkin Park had elements. Or, I'll say the opposite. They've, they're using some elements that Linkin Park used. They're using them differently. Like, you've got a clean vocalist. You've got the harsh vocals, which, being as notion, harsh vocalist, he killed it. He killed it. And, well, see, the, but Linkin Park's bad comparison, because Linkin Park actually used drums. I, I don't think they used, they, they used real drums in Catching the Wind. If they did, I think it's Catch the Wind, my bad. But if they did... It wasn't much. I think it was towards the end they might have. But most of it was like a digital boom, boom, boom. Like a, like a producer usually does. I liked it. Like, they're like, what the hell would we call their genre? It's not metal. It's not modern metal. Modern hardcore? Electronic hardcore? I, I don't know. Anyway, let's check this out. This is Lost. Hit the fucking like. Drink a beverage. Drinking water right now just because it's really hot in here. And last time I dehydrated all my... A lot of people, Patreon, in the comment section told me to drink some fucking water, bro. Gotcha. I'm listening now. I'm listening. I learned. <laughs> this comes from Valkyrie. Appreciate you so much. Let's check this out. Yeah, water's the MVP. I wonder if any of you have a request, there should be a Patreon thing right over here. Should be. So, yeah. We're not done! We're not done! It's hard to catch a breath when you live on the run! Just your <laughs> okay! Alright, I like what he's doing there with his voice. I like that. See there, I think, see, it's weird. There's real drums, I think. Unless he just is using a different instrumental on his beat pad. But it sounds like real drums. That's just fire. Like I, you don't you don't get that enough. Where a singer has his vocals going one sound during a bar and finishes it with a whole another. He's kind of doing clean vocals and then goes into a harsh. That's good. Talk to her!
I like them. Oh, yes. That was fire. Even the video was pretty goddamn good. Lyrics definitely connected with the lyrics. Oh, so that's actually one of their, uh, their, I would assume, wives. Last names are the same. It'd be weird if it's one of their sisters for the portrayal. That'd be fucking weird. So it better be it better be one of their wives, goddammit. But that was good. I think it was better than Catch the Wind. And I listened to Catch the Wind like a week ago. It, some songs, if they're good, they go to the playlist. I remember it popping up like a week ago. A week or two. I was in the shower. Leave me alone. It's pretty goddamn good. But this, it had so many unique things to it. And it, it, it the lyrically hit home. Fucking women, man. Fucking women. The bald guy? The harsh vocalist? Him? Him? Him I like. That guy's damn good. Some bands, like the clean vocalist, he's pretty good. He's pretty good. He's, he doesn't blow you away. His clean vocals aren't special. They're decent. They're definitely good enough. But the harsh vocalist, man. If this band ever got into an argument and broke up for some reason... Harsh vocalist would be perfectly fine. I think he could lead up because it sounds like he's got some clean vocal ability. I think he could do it. Now I would prefer them to stay together because they're they're a beautiful mix. But just saying, if they ever split for some reason, he's pretty goddamn good at what he does. <laughs> Loved the anger too. Love the anger. G any song that's good got good breakup anger. Oh. I love it. Love it. And then the memory at the end of them lying in bed of thinking of happier times. Everyone thinks. After a break, like when you reminisce or th the worst memories are like the bad ones and, oh, when she was a bitch and yelled at you. No, 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 no. The worst memories of a of an ex are the good ones. Holy shit, those haunt you to the grave. Those are the worst ones <laughs> by far. This was awesome. I actually wish it was longer. It was 350, which is probably a little more than a normal song. Oh, well, no, it's 330 plus credits. So 330, about a normal song by Duggett. I wish it was about five, <laughs> 450, five. I could have used one more chorus when the bridge was fire, too. That was a good one. I liked it. I like them. I, like them. I wish there were more bands that had this. Again, I don't know what genre, this genre, whatever the fuck you'd call them, this element, I like it. The modern uh, beat pad, using it as the, with the snare and the, that's, that's, that's beautiful. A lot of old heads might be pissed off. They want the instruments, cool. But there's a thousand billion bands that do it that way, which is great. It's nice to have a couple that don't. It just adds a different element. But if you are still here. And you are a real one. Stay hydrated. Stay hydrated. And then drink beer. Do both. <laughs>